How much do you desire to know Jesus and to have a deeper relationship with him? How much time do you devote to listening to his words and reflecting on it? Have you ever wished you were alive in Palestine during his time there? Jesus called his generation evil because they were not interested in him although he was performing miracles here and there in this place. They were curious but they lacked faith. They wanted signs but Jesus refused to give them more because obviously no number of signs would change them anymore. The Ninevites were pagans but they listened to Jonah and they were repented. Likewise, the queen of Sheba was pagan but she traveled to Jerusalem to hear the wisdom of Solomon. Yet, Jesus was greater than Jonah and Solomon but most people did not believe in him. They deserved to condemn. Today, Jesus is not physically around to show signs and wonders for us, yet signs and wonders of his presence are everywhere. We can see them if we have the eyes of faith. Of course, the signs and wonders of his works and words when he physically walked on earth are all in the scripture. We can read and know them if we so desire. In the book of Jeremiah chapter 29 verses 13 says like this, You will seek me and find me when you search for me with all your heart. May the Holy Spirit grant us the desire to seek the Lord and may we have the eyes of faith to be able to see and to appreciate His presence in us in our everyday life. God bless you all.